Well, today a sentencing hearing for a uh, ex Maryville College football player Riley Gall. We have been telling you about this case now for nearly two years. 16 year old Central student Emma Walker shot through her bedroom wall and killed. Gall convicted of first degree murder back in May. Well, today's hearing was for remaining charges. Six on your side reporter Madison Keevy joining us now here in the studio and Madison an emotional day for the Walker family. Well, absolutely. This hearing today in the same courtroom where just a few months ago, Emma Walker's friends and family watched Gall be put away in handcuffs. Tonight, we're hearing from those who were closest to Gall and to Walker, including her parents. I told them all the truth, like where I was, so like Friday, Saturday, Sunday. Played during his trial, a secret video of Riley Gall taken by his friends. Uh, you don't see me down. Friends Alex McCarty and Noah Walton testify during the trial. But tonight, in a 2020 special, ABC's Deborah Roberts speaks with them one on one. Were you worried about that? I was just fearful that maybe justice couldn't have been done if we made the wrong move. Tonight, an hour devoted to Emma Walker's story. Her parents speaking candidly, too, remembering the days following her death vividly. I knew what he was doing. If he was trying to scare her, he wouldn't have shot her where he could hurt her. Could have shot in the ground. Outside the house, not inside the house. He did it twice. From two different angles. Towards her head. I mean, that's not an accident. You've thought about it. It's calculated. And that story close to home, of course, for our community. We've also brought you moments of memorials and recognition for Emma Walker from her friends. So this episode, especially emotional for us here in Knoxville. Kristen.